Okay, we're here. My name is Leah. I'm at Hit Fit today, and this is the Tabata workout. Um, Amanda is here with me. She's going to demonstrate all the exercises. I'll show you, but then she's going to do the workout in the back because I have a little bit of an injury on my left hip, left glute. So it's better for me to rest. Um, I never thought I'd say I should rest more during quarantine, but here I am <laughs> resting more. So um, yeah, it's going to be sad for me not to be able to do the workout, but Amanda's going to kill it. So uh, Tabata. Usually 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, but we're gonna start with a warm up of 30 seconds for exercises. Um, yeah, try to stay moving during the moving parts. Put your own music on if you can't hear mine, just blast it for yourself. We're gonna get going. So we're gonna start with some jumping jacks. In three, two, and one. Here we go, jumping jacks. Doing good. This is going to be the worst part, just sitting still. But maybe I'll join for the core exercises and the upper body exercises. Okay, almost there, keep it going. You've got five seconds. Four, three, two, the next one you're gonna scissor your feet and you're gonna open and close the chest. Nice. You've got four exercises in the warm up, all 30 seconds, we're gonna do two sets total. Nice. You like this little head commentator in the corner. <laughs> Three, two, we're gonna do some forward lunges alternating. So one foot forward. Nice. So just make sure that when you're stepping, that your front knee does not pass the angle, right? So you make a nice good step. Perfect. Hands can be on the waist, you can also put them to your chest. Really nice. So upper body nice and tall. Three, two, we're going to come down into a plank position. Hips come into the air, downward facing dog. And you're going to step forward with one leg spider lunge. Good. Back to downward dog. Back to spider lunge on the other side. The so foot stepping all the way forward. Flat foot on the floor. Close to your front hand as you can. You really want to fit into that stretch. Exhale as you come forward. Inhale as you lift the hips up into the air. You have five seconds to go. Three, two, one. We go right back up to those jumping jacks. One more step of the warm up. So, Tabata is a quick workout, only 40 minutes today. Nice quick warm up, and then we get right into it. Doing great. <laughs> Good, 10 seconds more. Three, two, and one. We're going for those chest open scissors. Feet flat on the floor. Just a little bit of space between them. Really open your chest up wide. Ten seconds to go. Four, three, two. We go back to the lunges, alternating right and left. And pushing off that front heel, keeping the core engaged. Nice, stay with it, 10 seconds to go. Three, two, and the last 30 seconds, a downward facing dog into a spider lunge. Lift your hips nice and high, step into it. Open your hips open. Good, you've got 10 seconds more. Three, two, 
One, really nice. Okay, warm up is done. We're moving on to our Tabata. So, uh, a Tabata, like I said before, 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. Uh, in most of the Tabatas today, well, we'll do a little bit some things differently, but we're going to do four exercises, and each exercise you do twice before you move on to the new one. So you'll do 20 seconds of an exercise, 10 seconds rest, 20 seconds of the same exercise, 10 seconds rest, and then we'll move on. So when we do a Tabata like that, it's usually a more challenging exercise to start, and as we make our way through the Tabata, a little bit less challenging, still not, right? Um, in 20 seconds, you want to go all out, right? All out, and then the 10 seconds to rest. Um, yeah, if you don't jump, then you can always modify. I'll also show you some options. So, first exercise before we get started, I call it iron left. It's two jumping lunges, a squat, and a heel flip. Two jumping lunges, squat, heel flip. We're going to start in four seconds. Three, two, and one. Here we go. I call it iron legs because it makes your legs feel as heavy as iron. You're going to feel the burn right away. Keep it going. Nice. You can't go for the heel play, go for a squat jump instead. And if you're not jumping, you step through it as fast as you can. Four seconds. Three, two, and one. Ten seconds reps. Really good. You get to do it again. So you can shake your legs out if you want. Yeah, first 20 seconds already, right? Three, two, and one. Here we go again. Same thing. Two lunges, squats, heel clip. See if you can stay moving because it's only 20 seconds. Even if it burns, you know it's done soon enough. 10 seconds more. Woo! Killing it. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. Next exercise will be a jumping lunge. So just the jumping lunges. If you want to step through them, you can. You get five seconds and go for it. Three, two, and one. Yes, right into the jumping lunges. So again, remember that you don't want to push your front knee too far forward. You want to keep your chest nice and tall. Oh yeah, stay with it. That back knee better drop down towards the floor. Good, you're almost there. Five seconds to go. Woo! Four, three, two, and one. Awesome job. Lucky for us to get to do it again. Us. I say us like I need it. Okay, four seconds. Three, two, one, go. Jumping lunges. Nice. Try to stay moving the whole 20 seconds. All out. Max effort. Really beautiful. Jumping lunges. I taught her so well. <laughs> Five seconds to go. Push it. Four, three, two, and one. Shake the legs out. The next one is just the squat heel flip. Down. Flip your heels. Make sure you're reaching your hips back, clicking your heels at the top in three, two, and one. Here we go. Squat, heel flip. Perfect. Make sure every time you land, your hips reach back, and when you land on the floor, you're landing softly. Nice. Doesn't have to be too high of a jump, just enough air to click the heels together. You got four, three, two, and one. Nice. How the legs feel it? Woo! Nice burn to start, I'm sure. Okay, take that rest. We do the squat heel clip again. Three, two, and one. Okay. Yeah. She's got it. Good. You've got 10 seconds more. Last five. Four, three, two, and one. Last exercise is an in and out squat. Squat position. Jump in, jump out, stay low. So you never want to stand all the way up. We're ready for it. Two times through it. Okay, here we go. 20 seconds. In and out squats. Stay with it, stay with it. Nice and low. You got seven seconds to go. Five, four, three. Two, and one, nice, shake it out. Last 20 seconds and Tabata one is done. I know your lower body is burning. We'll take a break after this. Three, two, one, 20 seconds, last 20, staying low. When you jump in, your knees touch, you squeeze your inner thighs together, really good. Every time you land, a little bit of a pulse as well. You got 10 seconds to go. Chest is still lifted, core is engaged. Last five, stay moving, four, Three, two, one, done. Nice work. 
All right, that's one Tabata. Water if you need to, a little bit of a rest. How we do it? So, six Tabatas total, and we're on Tabata two now. So, that one was all about lower body, a little bit of power, a little bit of fly that chicks. Number two is all about speed, and we're also gonna do some plank jack variations. So, because you have eight sets total, on every odd set, all you're doing is a high knee run, and as fast as you can, lifting up nice and high. The even set, you're gonna do something different each time, yeah? So always a plank jack in a plank position, out and in with the feet. The first plank jack we do, we're going to do a shoulder tap. When the feet are out, you'll touch the shoulders, and when they're in, both hands are back to the floor. So first one is gonna be the high knees, right? We've got that odd set to start. Tabata two. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, and one. High knee run as fast as you can, right? Because this Tabata is all about speed, all about plank jacks as well. So it's all really about speed if you can make those plank jacks quick. Keep lifting. All about the core on this one as well. Five seconds. Four, three, two, still 10 seconds rest. But you can make your way down to the floor so you're ready to get into that plank jack position. Plank jack, shoulder tap. If you can't do that, stick with the plank jacks the whole time, that's okay. Here we go. When your feet are out, you're tapping one hand to the shoulder, your hands are right under your chest, and your fingers are spread wide so you have a lot of support for yourself. Keep it moving. If you want, can you speed it up? You got five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Take it up, 10 seconds rest, right back to the high knees. Nice, good job. Okay, four, three, two, and one. Nice, we're on set three, the odd set, high knee run. Nice speed round here. Just make sure you're still lifting nice and tall and your knees are coming, maybe past the waist, really lifting with the lower abdominals. Five, four, three, two, and one. Next one, in the plank jack, we're now going to do a forward raise. So front raise with the arms. In four, three, two, and one. So instead of tapping the shoulder, you're reaching one arm straight out in front of you. You can do the plank tap, but you can't do the forward raise. You do what makes it challenging for you, but that you can still keep going. Stay with it. Almost there. Last seven. Six. A little faster. Let's go. Four, three, two, and one. Awesome. You're halfway through the Tabata already. Back to the high knees in five seconds. So now we're on set five. Three, two, and one. Let's go. Nice. All core in this round as well, but cardio core the whole time. 10 seconds more. Maybe you speed it up if you can. You know you're almost there. You'll be able to do one more high knees after this. Four, three, two, and one. Next plank is one plank jack, one pike up. One plank jack, one pike up. Arms stay long in that plank position. We go in three, two, and one. Here we go. One jack, one pike. One jack, one pike. Really nice. So thinking about lifting your hips high in that pike up, using your lower abdominals still a lift. You got 10 seconds. We still want to keep that speed. You want to keep your arms locked nice and strong. You don't want those shoulders to slide back. Rest. Last high knees coming up. Last two sets into bottom two. We've got five seconds all out high knees. Let's go for it. Three. Two and one. Let's push it here. Really nice. I should have been doing this the whole time for my workouts. I can talk through this whole thing without being out of breath. This is amazing. Okay, 10 seconds more. And I look way better. Less sweaty, better hair. Okay, keep going. Four, three, two, and one. Last 20 seconds is going to be just a plank jack. Doesn't that seem so nice now instead of adding something fancy to it? So all plank jacks, three, Two and one, 20 seconds, let's go. Perfect. Nice walk, strong legs. Doesn't have to be a super wide jump out and in, but keeping those arms strong, stay with it. You're still breathing, focus on the breath. You've got five seconds faster. Four, three, two, and one. Another Tabata, done, awesome work. Whew, okay. So water if you need, have a little break. Tabata three, all about the core. So, 
This time, in the 20 seconds of work, we do the same exercise. And normally, in the 10 seconds where we rest, now we're gonna do something else. So then the whole four minutes we're working. If you need a break because you're losing your form, you just take one, you shake it out, you squeeze your knees to your chest, you get right back into it. So the two exercises are, see, first, the 20 second exercise, tabletop position, a lift, and a cross reach. You're coming all the way up, almost like a sit up position. That bothers you. Stay lower to the floor, more of a crunch. In the 10 second, we roll up to a teaser position. Legs are lifted, Russian twist, side to side. You no longer keep your legs lifted, or it's half to feet down and hold. Yes? So 20 seconds, we're going for those cross reaches. Okay, so set it up, getting ready. Three, two, and one. Here we go. So we've got that tabletop cross reach all the way up. Nice. You want to try to keep those legs 90 degrees the whole time, and you're twisting as you reach. Awesome. Keep it up. Three, two. Now roll all the way up to home, and you've got those Russian twists. If holding here, just holding, your hands help your legs. Here, you can hold here and that's fine. Otherwise, we're back down, 20 seconds. Cross reach, really nice. And just remember, it gets too challenging, you squeeze your knees to your chest, you take a rest, you keep moving through it. It may be quite challenging to go for this whole four minutes, but that's the goal, five seconds. Four, three, two, and roll up, hold. Okay, you always tap the feet to the floor. Nice. I feel it. <laughs> it comes real quick, that bird, I think. Three, two, and one, back down. Tabletop, cross reach. Now, if your neck is bothering you, your head, you can put your hands behind your head, and you can do more of an assisted sit up like that. Keep it going, you've got seven seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Roll it up, back to that twist, here we go. Good, good, good. Three, two, one. We're back down. Let's reach it. Here we go. Up. We're going to do this one. We're going to take a short rest and we're going to go for the last four sets. So keep it going. Ten seconds. Reaching still across the body, but to the ceiling. Three, two, one. Come up. Rush and twist. See, you can full range of motion, twist side to side. Belly is scooped towards the spine, chin is lifted from the chest, two, and one. Roll it down, take a second. Deep breath in and out. Okay, whatever you need. Five seconds, we get right back into it. Last four sets, three, two, one. Here we go, 20 seconds. Going for that big reach and burn. Remember, you can always modify it a bit towards the end if you need to. You don't want to sacrifice our form just to get all the way up there. Good, five seconds more. Exhale as you lift, use the breath. Three, two, and one, roll it up. Yeah, nice, side to side. Big core bird. Almost there, three, two, one. Okay, back down again, we're on set, sit. Woo! Keeping those legs tabletop if you can. Option, feet go to the floor if you need. Five seconds more, keep it going. Four, three, two, and one. Nice, back up. Russian twist for 10 seconds, even less now. Five, four, three, two, and one. Last two sets, can you stay with it? Let's go. It gets a lot harder, doesn't it? This is where you really gotta breathe. Almost there, seven seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one up, Russian twist. Can you keep those legs off the floor for this last even less than 60 seconds? Let's take it down. Here we go, back to the floor. Last 30 seconds of work. First those cross reaches, last 20 seconds, right into it. Woo! You've got 10. Keep it going, keep it going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Keep 
four, three, two, roll it up. Last 10 seconds, hold twist, maybe you speed up the finish. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome. Halfway through, almost. Okay, so we've got six total Tabatas, but in between the three Tabatas and the three, we do 60 seconds of one exercise. We count how many reps we do, and we try to beat that score at the very end of class. When I asked Amanda if she would do this for me in this class, I said, is there anything you don't want to do? And she said, not a lot of burpees. Like, okay, so we're not doing a full burpee, but we're doing a half burpee. So a half burpee is just the bottom half of the burpee. Your chest comes to the floor, your hands stay on the floor, all the way down, and then as you push yourself up, you lift your feet up towards your hands. Flat feet on the floor, that's one. Two, hands stay on the floor the whole time. If you can't push yourself up, you can step it forward and step it back. As many half burpees as you can in 60 seconds, and you're counting. You gotta remember that number. Are you ready? She looks so ready. Okay, you're ready at home as well. Let's set it up. We'll start in five, four, three, two, and one. How many half burpees can you do in 60 seconds? Chest to the floor, and as soon as you push up, your feet come forward. Your hands stay on the floor the whole time. This is a little bit of lower abdominal and chest. Keep it up. Big exhale as you lift. Try to push yourself and lift your feet in one go. Yeah, nice. Woo, good thing she's small. She's closer to the floor. <laughs> You're halfway there, so keep counting. You've got it. 30 seconds. Woo, gets harder towards the end. We're working. So this is as close to a push-up as you're going to do in today's class, so that's so bad, right? Okay, almost there. Final 15 seconds. We're going to push it. We want to really take that number up there. Last 10 seconds to go. Breathe through it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work. How did you get? 17. Hopefully you guys at home got close to that as well. Remember your number. If it was lower, if it was higher, it doesn't matter. We're going to try to beat it at the end of class. So hopefully you didn't just go slow just so you can beat your score. But now we're truly halfway through the workout. Three more Tabatas to go. Tabata number four, we're doing some squats, we're doing some tuck jumps. So two lower body Tabatas in today's class. Sorry about it. Okay. We're going to start with a one or a 90 degree turn into a squat, so a 90 degree turn into a tuck jump. Knees off, take up that high. <laughs> then you'll turn again, tuck jump, turn again, tuck jump. So every turn, your squat turn, hold, push from the floor. 90 degrees, tuck jumps all the way around. We're going to do that two times. It's going to be a tough one. If you don't jump, squat, knee, turn, squat, knee, turn. You can do the opposite knee in the second set. All right, four, three, two, one. Let's go. 90 degrees into the tuck jump. The knees go nice and high. This one, a killer one, especially after those half burpees, after three Tabata sets already. 10 seconds more. Woo! She's never going to do this for me after this. She's like, why didn't you kill me? Two and one. Rest. 10 seconds, next one around, same thing, but reverse your direction. All right, ready for it. Three, two, and one. Okay, let's go. 20 seconds, tuck and turn. Nice, knees still lift, we're pushing from the floor, pushing from the heels of the feet, low from the floor so you can lift up high. Back four, three, two, and one. 10 seconds. Next one, we're gonna do 360 squats until you come all the way to the front, then one tuck jump, yeah? Then all the way around the reverse direction. Here we go. So squats all the way around, only one tuck jump when you face forward, and then you're gonna reverse your direction, squats around, exactly. If you're not jumping, you can step into the squats and still do your squat knee. Five seconds to go, four, three, two, rest. Woo! We're gonna do that one more time. 
Take a deep breath. Four, three, two, and one. Let's go again. All the way around, plus one tuck jump. A lot of tuck jumps in one Tabata, I'm telling you. Ten seconds. Good. Keep it up. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. All right. Next one is the 360 squat. Just all the way around. Once you get to the front, you're going to reverse your directions. No tuck jumps. Yeah, here we go. 20 seconds. Keep it moving. 10 seconds to go. Last five, four, three, two, one. Killer. Okay, first nice work. How does the legs feel it? Five seconds, 360 squats again. Breathe. Three, two, and one. Keep the chest lifted. Keep reaching your hips back, right? The second your legs get tired, you don't want to do the proper form, right? Your body doesn't want to let you. But you're going to stay with it. Push through the back of the feet. Almost there. Seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Last one, just a squat jump. Straight up, straight down, 20 seconds. Got to keep it moving. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Just a squat jump. If you need to, keep your feet on the floor. Regular squats are fine. Keep moving. This is your last exercise up to bottom four. And then the lower body, take it a little break. Keep it up. Five seconds, come on. Four, three, two, and one. Awesome. Last 20 seconds coming up. Okay, five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Let's hit it. Squat jumps to finish. Oh, so neat. Lower body, the bottom in the first half of class and the second, but we're going for it. 10 seconds to go. We got all weekend to run. Seven. Six, five, keep it going, push it. Four, three, two, and one, yeah. It's harder when you're on camera because there's no spot to rest, except for when you're at home, you're like, oh, they don't think I'm gonna break. Awesome, awesome job. Okay, the next Tabata, upper body Tabata. So we're gonna give the legs a little rest. We're going for the triceps, with some tricep dips, yeah? Just remember that when you're in a tricep dip, your fingers are facing your feet. Your hips are lifted. Your elbows bend, right? I always see this in classes. So if this is you, just remember. Bending the elbows back, pushing through the heel of the hand. The first exercise we're gonna do is one dip, one reach. Bend, lift, okay? If that's not for you, one dip, one leg lift. And you can skip the reach because it takes a little bit of coordination and a little bit a core strip. Okay, tricep dip, alternating reach. Every time both hands on the floor, right into the tricep dip again. We'll start in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. 20 seconds, tricep dip reach. Nice. Work in the back of those arms. 10 seconds. We're gonna feel a huge burn in our tricep by the end of this. Three, two, shake it out, rest. Just stay where you are. We're gonna do it again. Every exercise, two times. In four, three, two, and one. Okay, right into it again, same exercise. As soon as those hands touch the floor, you're down in that dip. Let's see if you can speed it up to finish. Nice, five. Four, three, two, one. Awesome work, rest. Next one, a single leg tricep dip. Right leg is gonna come up first, and we're just going down and up. 20 seconds, and then we'll switch legs. Here we go. Really nice. So I wanna keep the hips lifted. We push that right leg to the ceiling. 10 seconds more. You need to you put both feet down and move it fast. Four, three, two, one. Shake it out. Now we're going to do it with the left leg up. 
Deep breath in and out. Five seconds we go. Four, three, two, and one. Let's hit it. That's it. She loves tricep hips. She tells me all the time. This is not something she asked me not to do. She fishes. Ten seconds. Good. Almost there. Five seconds to go. Four, three, two, and one. Really nice job. Shake it up. Next one, we're doing speed tricep dips. Both feet on the floor. Small little bend and lift, but fast. Three, two, and one. Here we go. You see if you can stay in it for that 20 seconds. If you need a second, you drop the hips to the floor, take a breath, and keep pushing really nice. Elbows push back, making it small, but you can feel that isometric small little movements in those muscles. Three, two, one. Awesome. Shake it up. Woo! Okay, back to those speed tricep dips. We're coming for it in four, three, two, and one. Here we go. Awesome. Stick with it. 15 seconds. Pushing those elbows back. It's so small that I bet you can feel that burn. You got it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. Last exercise. A slow four count tricep dip. Four, three, two, one. Back up. Two, three, four. Here we go. Set it up. Four. Three, two, one, and up. Four, three, two, back down again. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, five seconds. Four, three, two, back up. Four, three, two, rest. Woo! One more to go. You can do that. Okay, four, three, two, here we go. Slow. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, four, three. On this last one, I want you to hold it down there. Just hold. Hold, hold, hold. Three, two, and rise. Nice job. Your wrist a little roll. Shake it out. Woo! Tabata. Always a killer, right? Okay. You made it to the final Tabata. Tabata number six. I call this like the max out round because we take four exercises from the Tabatas we've already done. We do each exercise two times and that's it, right? Four exercises, two times through, one exercise from each Tabata or some of them. Yeah, so every exercise you see, you've already done once. Now you can see your old friends again. But this is it, after that. One more minute and a half burpees, we're gonna beat our score, and then you're done. So four minutes of work, but even less because you have that 10 seconds in between. All right, last push here. First exercise, we start with the iron legs. Two lunges, one squat, one lift. 20 seconds, ready, ready. Okay, five seconds till we start. Four, three, two, and one. Here we go, lunge, lunge, squat, heel click. Let's push it. Full 20 seconds. Keep it going, keep it going. 10 seconds more. Last five, four, three, two, one. Woo, shake it out one more time. So shake those legs. The last Tabata, only the killer, but you know you're so close to that. Three, two, and one, let's go. Lunge, lunge, squat, heel click, yes. Landing softly in that squat again. Keep it going, woo! She's crushing it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, awesome. Next one is the plank jack, shoulder tap. Okay, gonna get down to that plank position. We start in four, three, two, and one. Plank jack. Shoulder tap, flat hands on the floor. Oh, so much coordination involved. Get to breathe through it again. Keep it up. Last 10 seconds, can you speed up? That's it. Woo! Five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Do it again. In five, four, three, 
two, and one. Slay jack, shoulder tap, you got it. Ten seconds to go, keep it up. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Awesome. We're going to stand up. The next exercise is a 360 squat. One tuck jump at the front. Reverse. Only one tuck jump. 360 squat. One tuck jump. Here we go. 20 seconds. All the way around. Keep it moving. Last lower body exercise of the day. Keep moving. Nice high tuck jumps because also last side tuck jumps. Four, three, Two and one. Rest. One more time through this one. One more exercise left. In five, four, three, two, and one. Three sixty squats. I want some nice, powerful touch up. Knees are lifting up to the armpits. Woo! Keep it up. That core is working. Ten seconds more. Let's go. Nice. Soft landing on that touch up. In five, four. Three, two, and one. The last exercise in this Tabata, a speed tricep dip. Break again, nice and small. In four, three, two, and one. 20 seconds of those speed dips again. Just when we thought we did enough tricep dips. Here they are again. Hello, friends. Good. Push those elbows back. Push those arms long at the top. Keep it up. Five seconds. Four. Three, two, and one. Okay, 10 seconds to rest it. The last 20 seconds of this Tabata, and then you're done with every Tabata. Just 60 seconds left in the class. Three, two, and one. Here we go, 20 seconds. Let's push it here. Awesome. It looks so small, but you know, it's working. It's effective, you can feel it. 10 seconds to go, keep it up, keep it up. Woo, breathe it. Five seconds, four. Three, two, one, and rest. Six total Tabatas. So quick to go through this workout, but so damn effective. So take a second to take a breath. We'll take about 60 seconds to recover a bit, to give yourself a fighting chance on those half burpees. Then we're going for it because the sooner you do it, the sooner you're done, the sooner you cool down and stretch. Okay, about 30 seconds to go. And then we're on that 60 seconds, trying to beat that score you had before. You remember it? Are you determined? I know it. You can do it. Okay. Are you ready? We'll start. In five, four, three, two, and one. 60 seconds, half burpees. This is it. Much harder, I know, after six to the bottom. Keep it up, keep it up. 45 seconds left. This is you against yourself, your own personal goal. If you don't make it, that's just something to work towards in the future. Keep moving, keep pushing. You have 30 seconds left, you're halfway there. Are you halfway to that number? And you just keep moving, keep breathing, keep pushing. You're doing awesome, Amanda. You're doing amazing, sweetie. <laughs> keep it up, keep it up. Almost there, 20 seconds, even less now, you've got it. 15 to go, so try to keep moving. After this, it's done. You can push a little more, last 10. Nine, eight, she's on it, she's going for it. Five, four, three, two, and one, yes. We can beat the score. Nice work. Okay, some water, let's cool it down. Woo! She killed it. Ooh, I'm gonna keep her for the Tabata every time. <laughs> okay, when are you ready? Just stay standing. Woo. Now I get to stretch. <laughs> so hard for me. Okay, wide stand to the left. Toes slightly turned up. It's gonna take a big inhale, reach up tall. We're gonna fold and just reach down to the floor. While you're down here, you can just shake your head forward and back slow. You can shake your head side to side. Then we're going to walk the hands over to the right leg and just hold for a few breaths. I'm going to keep the legs straight so if you can't reach the left before you just come a little higher. Okay, 
And over to the other side. One more breath over here. Back to the center. Now we're going to move into a lateral stretch. We're going to bend the right knee. Maybe the hands walk to the right side. The hands can also walk up and top. Hips are sitting back. Double breath here. You can always walk your stance a little wider as well. And then over to the other side. It did look like fun though. I, I kind of missed that. <laughs> I'm sure it'll get me back somewhat. Okay, back to the center. Walk the feet to come under the hips. We're going to roll up. Okay, go for a quad stretch. You can hold on to something or just keep your balance. Knees pull in towards each other. Good. One more big breath in through the nose. Out of the mouth. And then if you can, wrap your right leg over your knees. See if you can sit back into a figure four stretch. Holding on to something. You can also do this on your back, lying down. Nice. Slowly up. Right foot on the floor. Left leg into the quad stretch. Now I really owe you a coffee. <laughs> That's how I brag there. Okay, left leg on top of right. Sit back. Come all the way up. We're gonna roll the ankle, just one standing on one leg. We're rolling the ankle in one direction. Reverse the circle. All that jumping, all that plyometrics, important stuff. Okay. Reverse. Nice. Just an upper body stretch. Here we go for a tricep stretch. Right knee behind the head, left hand is pulling down the right elbow. This one should feel pretty good for you after all of those minutes. <laughs> okay, no push up, no full burpees. I did kind of. Uh, Follow through on the comments. <laughs> and then switch to the hard part. Yeah. Okay, big inhale, reach up, fingers together at the top, palms push up to the ceiling, we'll just take a nice side stretch. Tall, other side. Back up. Let's finish with four breaths all together. A big inhale, reach up tall. Big open up. Exhale. Okay, two more. And the last one, hands can touch together above your head. Exhale as you bring your hands to your hearts. Big clap and air high five for Amanda. She did freaking amazing. Um, yeah, have a great day. Drink some water. Make sure if you want to stretch a little bit more, you're welcome to. Um, yeah, well, I couldn't leave you a Friday without a Tabata, but I'm sure all of you are praying that I can heal quickly so that you don't have to be in this position next time. <laughs> Unless you want to, let me know. So, thanks so much. Uh, yeah, so. Thank you.